Cheers, muses. I'm Erica Papillon Posey, and welcome to another segment of Suits Souls by EPP, where I inspire you with timeless classic prim looks from my boudoir. But today, we're going to do something a little different. Now, I know that typically I have focused on a color scheme or a design element in garments, but I really wanted to focus today on the souls part of Suits Souls by EPP with five, that's right, five shoe selections that I have recently acquired. Yes, they were all gifts to me for the holiday because everyone knows how much I love handbags, but soles primarily. And actually I do have one handbag that I would also like to share with you as well that was purchased to go with one of the set of soles that I'm going to share with you. Now let's see, of the five, we are featuring three pairs from Jeffrey Campbell, one from Vince Camuto, and then another one from the Kurt Geiger collection. Woo! And that tote, that handbag that I'm telling you about, um, it actually comes from TJ Maxx. Now I really love purchasing my uh, handbags from TJ Maxx and Marshalls. Uh, whenever I purchase the leather ones, I have a tendency to focus on the Italian made handbags because they wear well. And as I've stated to you in previous episodes, the Italians are known for their leather goods. So if you ever have the opportunity to travel to Italy, always bring an extra suitcase or prepare to purchase one when you get there so that you can bring some of those leather goods home. The Italians are fire when it comes to leather goods. So let's get started. The first pair of soles that I want to share with you today is this Vince Camuto boot. Now look, this boot is fire. The wonderful, wonderful detailing in this boot should not be ignored. Look at the studding that goes along the shaft of the boot, right? I mean, just fire, along with this generous platform and this stacked heel makes for wear very easy, very comfortable, and you can wear these for some hours. Now, yes, I got these as a Christmas gift, but I have worn them once already because they're so amazing. And the leather is so supple. It looks like it might be stiff, but that's because I have a, a boot shaper on the inside to keep its form, which I do for all of my boots. And uh, yes, these are just stunning. And I can't wait to get really copious amounts of wear out of this beauty. Again, it is Vince Camuto. Everything that is still available, I will link for you in the description. So never worry. But these are just amazing, right? These are just Fantastic. This is the only pair of boots that I will be showing you today, but I really needed to show these to you. And actually they're on sale right now. When I purchased them, I think I got about 20% off, but they're even uh, cheaper right now. So they are on sale. Again, Vince Camuto, I will link them for you. The second pair of soles that I have that I want to show you and I actually am just opening them all now. So we're kind of seeing them together with the exception of the uh, boot that I just showed you. This is a Jeffrey Campbell suede. Look at this pointed toe pump with this really art deco, just geometric um, abstract design to the heel. Just wonderful, so beautifully made, all suede, as you might imagine, with the leather lining to it. And yes, that heel is gold, right? Oh, these are just wonderful. And I also love the, um, the foot, the base of the shoe. I love the texture of it. It's not that slip and slide thing that you find on really uh, inexpensively made shoes. But these are just, oh, just amazing, aren't they? Look at that, right? They kind of remind me of some Brian Atwoods that I recently purchased. And when I say recently, I think they are about mm, 
about three months ago or so. But remember that Brian Atwood shoe, which you can see on my Instagram page, Suits Souls by EPP. The Brian Atwood had that beautiful, um, just attention to detail with the monogram that he put on the inside of the heel. This heel does not have a, a monogram to it, but it really reminds me of that with that gold highlight and feature here. Just wonderful. And the bag that I chose, it was on my list, to go with this shoe, I think is a beautiful marriage, a beautiful pairing. Now, again, I'm just opening this bag. Ah! Now, remember, I was telling you that the Italians make wonderful bags. Yes, they do. Now, look, come on now. This bag is stunning, is it not? Is it not? Remember, the Cheval is the name of the brand. This is an Italian brand, Cheval, C-H-E-V-A-L, from um, the TJ Maxx. I will link it for you in the description. It is still available on the TJ Maxx website. But doesn't it go beautifully with this heel? Just that, look at the, the, uh, the gold hardware around the circular handle of the tote that goes quite well. Look at that with the goal of the shoe. Oh, I can't wait to style these for you. Right? Just stunning. Just a stunning pair. I love it. I love it. I love it. I hope you like what I'm going to do with it. Next pair. Let's get to it. The Kurt Geiger. Now, I've been a fan of Kurt Geiger for some time. I've been looking at this shoe for some time. I am just opening them. I intentionally had not opened them because I wanted to unbox them with you. Look at this. This is called the Belgravia. This is all suede with a three and a half inch heel on this pump and this fabulous Shoreditch bow on it. And you know, Kurt Geiger is a um, UK brand, but look how beautiful, just stunning. And of course I have the matching, um, you can wear it as a, a, um, um, a clutch or as a crossbody. but for the Kurt Geiger and the really elevated nature of this shoe, the bow is also on the clutch. Um, you, you don't want to wear it as a crossbody. I really don't care for crossbody wear for handbags because it really pairs down and, um, it, it just doesn't elevate any look to me. It just looks too casual. Now, if I'm doing something casual and I need to wear something as crossbody, yes. But generally speaking, I'm always going for the clutch look. It's just more elevated with these beauties. Look at that. How fire. Wonderful. And yes, there is some baby blue detailing in there inside. When you look, when you, uh, I wish you could see the detailing in this bow. It is so beautiful, just really well constructed, really, really well made. I mean, lots of love and care was put into this pump. And once again, I cannot wait to see what you think about these styled when I get the matching clutch to it. Right? And look at that footbed, this quilted like footbed, so comfortable. Oh, super cute, Kurt Geiger. Next up, we have another Jeffrey Campbell. Now, this shoe, this shoe is one pair of two in the same color. And remember, I told you that whenever I love a shoe, I love a shoe, I will buy it in multiple colors if I love it that much. But this baby, the juxtaposition of the daintiness of a ballet slipper, look at the toe there. Look at the toe there. Doesn't it remind you of the ballet shoe? The juxtaposition against this industrial heel, this severe industrial four inch heel with, look at this, oh my God. Now, if I were not a singer growing up, 
fulfill that dream, of course. But one of my second dreams was always to be a ballet dancer. And now I can do it stylishly, right? And yes, it is satin with this beautiful, dainty little bow on top. Again, just this real juxtaposition of this satin um, daintiness, but really severeness uh, against the this heel, this steel metal um, severe heel. I am in love and I cannot wait to style these for you as well. And yes, these are really um, white. They're more like an off-white. They're showing up white, but they're more like an off-white and ivory per se. But I also purchased them in black. They came in three colors. They came in a beautiful powder baby blue. This um, white, which again is really more like an ivory. And then black satin as well. So let me just show you really quickly the black one. Yes, here is the black, right? Wow, these are just so amazing, so beautiful. I can't pull the paper out because again, I'm just opening them. So forgive me for the crunching of the paper, but I really wanted you to see what the black ones look like. Just so cute, right? Right? Still elevated, um, still... There is this timeliness to this shoe, timelessness to this shoe that makes it fitting for any period, any period. So I know that you're going to love these. In black, you can style them in so many different ways. So be sure to check the link in the description. These are also on sale right now with Jeffrey Campbell. And you might want to snag them because I know that they were running out um, uh, every time I get notifications, you know, on upcoming sales and things like that, I saw that these were actually low in stock. So be sure to check it out if you like them. Again, three colors they're available in, this black satin, the white ivory satin, as well as the powder baby blue. Wonderful, right? Just beautiful. So that was it. That was our five pair of new acquisitions. Um, to my collection, in addition to this brown tote that I received from TJ Maxx and, uh, yeah, the boot from Vince Camuto, right? Oh, these are so comfortable. And, yes, the shaft is – it, actually, I wanted to tell you, the shaft on that boot is available in wide as well. So if you're worried about, you know – problems with having a larger size calf, it also comes in wide. Even though mine isn't in wide, it's just in the regular offering, but it still gives you uh, copious amounts of room in the shaft area. So I imagine that the wide option is very generous. So there you have it, five sets of soles. And uh, I'm super excited to style those for you. Thank you so very much for joining me on this segment of Suits Souls by EPP. And don't forget to head on over to Instagram and follow me there as well. Again, Suits Souls by EPP. Thank you so very much. Until we meet again, a bientôt, music. Bye.